is going on everybody gamers crossing here with your weekly upload your saturday upload today i have a new game for you guys called red hot vengeance this is a free game you can go find it on steam right now and let's see what this is all about guys uh so the description right over here he had one rule no killing women or children uh when a hitman is double crossed by his employer he brings forth a night of carnage and bloodshed Ooh, spicy <laughs> So here's a couple of the thumbnails, guys. You can go find these on Steam. Uh, not a whole lot else to say, guys. Let's just go ahead and jump into the video. But before we do, if you like this video, guys, be sure to strike that like button and subscribe for all future videos and future content. If you guys have not done so already, ah, every time, guys, I almost get through it, but I ch uh, choke. <laughs> If you have not done so already, guys, be sure to also hit that little post notification bell that is right beside the subscribe button so you guys are notified me to myself or Armando uploads a new video. And let's just go ahead and jump into this right now. All right, you guys, so we're here at the beginning and we're just going to go through this quick tutorial. So it looks like WASD is to move around. Uh, what is this? Shift is to pan the camera. So wherever you put your little crosshairs and then hit shift. That's where it pans out to. Oh, that's pretty cool. Uh, follow arrows to the objective. Um, so it's either this arrow or that arrow. Okay, so this arrow points you to the next objective. The next objective. The next objective. Oh my god. The next objective. There we go. Pronunciation. Uh, so E is to take the gun. There we go. R is to reload. Cool. So now we're packing. Now we're packing some heat. Uh, oh, are these little targets here? Nice. There we go. Headshot. Boom. Uh, one, two, three, four is quick swap. That could be very useful. And what is this? Uh, middle mouse or F is to lock on to an enemy. All right. Didn't stand a chance. Didn't even see me coming. There's some health. Gonna keep following the arrows. G to drop weapon. Uh, you can access your gun from the trunk, so E. And then primary is locked. Uh, sidearm 2, the M11 handgun, and sidearm 1 is as well. Left and right mouse uh, fire while dual wielding. Oh, you can dual wield in this game? Oh, it's like Halo 2. <laughs> uh, wait, what did I press? Oh, whoops. Accidentally hit tab. So let me go to... Yeah, there we go. I want this all... Oh, mouse wheel switch targets while locked on. Okay. Huh? Oh the man. Oh, language, mister. There we go. Tab is to view current objective. Tutorial. <laughs> what is this? Uh, use key cards to unlock doors. All right, so I got a key card. Door is unlocked. Uh, key rebinding and aim assist are available in the settings menu. All right. Okay, I guess that's the end. Oh shoot, here we go. I have a job for you. I need details. Ooh. Subway station. Lots of armed guards. High profile target? <laughs> that's gonna cost extra. Not high profile. Bit of a family man. With some friends in high places. Family man? You know I don't kill women and children. I know. We have that covered. He's traveling by himself, aside from his guards. Traveling alone on the subway? No crowds? How high up are his friends? He's a friend of the Russians, an accountant by the name of Dmitry Chekhov. You'll find more details in the glove compartment. So, the Russians, Dmitry Chekhov, and... <laughs> It's, it just always seems like it's the Russians to me. It's never anybody else. It's always the Russians. Uh, so we got that uh, that gun out of the trunk. Uh, you said there was something in the glove compartment. Can we go into the glove compartment? I don't think we can. All right, so we're just going to head down here into the subway. Uh, board the train. Uh, okay, I have to wait for it to stop. And it is gone. Oh, we have to fall. Oh, we probably have to go down. Gotcha. Oh, shoot. Get back here. Why are they keep... Man. These are some dumb bots. Come here. It's 
right, son. You but Oh shoot! I was looking at that guy right there. Oh no! I was killing civilians! Sure. Oh no! I am so sorry. I didn't know. Oh my gosh. I feel like an absolute idiot now. I just killed civilians. Wow. My bad guys. I'm sorry. Well now you know. The more you know. <laughs> I'm sorry I killed your friend. I'm sorry, come back. I want to apologize. Hey, you, come back here. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right, I got to continue on with my mission. I got to go get Chekhov. Oh, there's the train I need to board, but there's two Russians in the way. Here we go. Got them. Let's go ahead and board this train. Ooh. I'll take that for sure. Got an Uzi. Ow. Must have been on his phone or something. Oh! Man, catch you guys, like, snoozing. Oh, look at this guy. He's dead asleep. Oh. Love that aiming, don't you? <laughs> I wasn't locked on. Ooh. Get that, too. Hey. Let's see. There we go. Can I dual wield these? Oh my gosh, I can. Oh, this is totally like Halo 2. Oh my gosh, that Rex. Get out of the way. Yeah, there's a lot of health in here. They really assume I was gonna die? Why is that train slowing down? Oh! Wow. Cool. Take on me. What is this? Oh, I might die here. I might die here. I might. I. I. I died. I was not anticipating them shooting through the windows that precisely. That was a little extreme, if you ask me. But it is what it is. I definitely want to get another uh, Uzi though and dual wield it. That seemed to be the way. Just gonna go take this guy's real quick. Thank you. Go ahead and pick up this. Then uh, let's go back here. Reload both of these. Thank you, thank you. Get to the front of the train. Thank you, gentlemen. Your kind contribution. I gotta go stale. Stall. Gotta go stop checkoff now. What? Oh, I gotta reload. Well, let me get some health. I definitely don't want to die here again. I almost had him. Okay, okay, okay. I'm sorry. What? Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna stay back here. Alright, kill Chekhov. No problem. Man, those guys almost got me again. That's pretty difficult. Oh, nice. You can shoot through the doors. That's cool. You play too much. And this dual wielding is OP. Especially when you lock on. Uh-oh. There's three of them up here. Kill remaining enemies. What? What happened? Uh oh. Oh no. Get bodied. <laughs> well, that's intense. All right, you guys, that is going to conclude this episode of Red Hot Vengeance. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to strike that like button and subscribe for all future videos and future content. And if you guys have not done so already, be sure to also hit that little bell button, which turns on post notifications so you guys are notified of either myself or Armando uploads a new video. And wow, guys, this was a really fun game. For a free game, uh, there's a lot to offer. There's more levels on uh, this game, you know, for the campaign, and there's also... A few extra things on here that I'm not going to spoil. I'll save them for a future video. But it is a lot of fun. Um, if you guys go get it, um, 
Just make sure you use the uh, lock on, which is F. I found F was easier than middle scroll button, but it might be different for you, uh, but it, it helps out tremendously. And then also dual wielding those Uzis, unstoppable, so unstoppable. But uh, yeah, guys, so that's gonna conclude the video, like I said, and until next video, guys, like always, Semper Fi and carry on. Peace.